my gorgeous sparkly scriptures tasty juicy tourists welcome to web tarot reading this is going to be your general messages from the goddess of love today we're doing something a little bit different a little bit more spiritual these will be channeled messages from the goddess aphrodite this is her sea behind me baby so uh this uh, should be a very deep deep reading my darling we're gonna go deep to her <laughs> it's just how I, just how we like it it's blue angel love tarot oh my god okay let's Let's see, uh, please show me Goddess Aphrodite for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What are the challenges? What are what things are going for my darling Sparky Taurus? Only the best for my Taurus, you know that. Ooh, someone's spying on you. Somebody wants to know more about you, baby. What's going on? And the Magician at the bottom of the deck. So, uh, uh, Page of Swords and the Magician. Mm, someone's watching, you got a stalker, okay? But I feel like in a good way, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, also, Taurus, uh, welcome to Blue Angel Love Tarot. If you're new and if you are a returning Blue Angel, thank you. I appreciate you. I love you. I see you, baby. Give me a kiss. Mm -hmm. My darling sweet sparkly Taurus says, I'm Scorpio Sun and Rising. If you don't know yet, all right, that's why I love my Taurus energy because we're two sides of the same love coin, all right? We got the same love currency. We just spend it in different ways. <laughs> all right, anyway, whatever. I'm like, I'm like the, whatever, I'm the credit card, you are the, you know, whatever, the gold, uh, gold plated little gold coins or something. You know what I mean? It's like the same thing, it's just different format. Anyways, baby, <laughs> I really love you, Taurus, because you belong to the goddess. The bull belongs to the goddess. Um, yeah, someone's spying on you, someone's obsessed with you. It could be an ex, baby. Be careful. Let's see if this ex is any good. Yeah, yeah, somebody wants to get back with you. Uh, they want to. They want to bring love to you because they're sorry for what happened. Because you got the, you got the three of pentacles at the bottom of that, and then uh, the knight of uh, mm, cups charm. Sorry, I gotta go, oh, hold the cards tight uh, in, in case they, you know, swim away into the sea. Someone's obsessively looking at you. If you don't have an ex in your life. It is a new person or a person about to come in. So put yourself out there, baby. Put yourself out there on the social medias, all right? Put, put those beach photos out there. Uh, go on the beach. Maybe it's a, a cute lifeguard. Who knows, all right? Just saying. Um, something might happen. Because uh, the energy here is if people have their eyes on you. One specific person is obsessively looking at you. I do feel like for most of you it's an ex, but you know your story best. And I'm just a random bimbo on the internet anyway. So take what I say with a grain of salt, my scrumptiousness. Okay, let's see what the challenge is here. So look, Taurus, it's up to you. You know, I, I don't know. We'll see what the goddess of Rodides has to say about it. I don't think she's hating that ex of yours. I don't think she hates them because I, I feel like they truly regret whatever happened. So I don't know, but someone could be communicating with you very soon. But right now they're watching. So the challenge for you is that you're not seeing something here. Uh, Two of Swords, what is it that Taurus isn't seeing? Yeah, that's interesting. I think you're giving people too many chances, my scriptures darling, uh, beautiful Taurus. I think you gave that person from the past too many chances. They became complacent. They got they got to thinking they must be the bee's knees because the Taurus keeps forgiving because the Taurus has that beautiful, lovely, dovely heart, okay, that I love so much, baby. I'm in love with you, Taurus. <laughs> Let's be honest. Like, I just love my Taurus energy. I've never met a Taurus that I was like, nah, that's a bad person, you know? Like, it's always a good person. Uh, anyways, Two of Swords is you're not seeing just how many chances you're giving to other people. Stop doing that. Uh, you're not seeing um, how cold and aloof that person from the past was. You were with someone or you were talking to or dating someone who was just like, like, you see the good in people, Bibi, you know? You see the good in people. And this person was like, this person like low-key psycho. That, you know, that's a psycho. That King of Swords, dark energy could be low-key a psycho. This is someone who studied you. They studied you. They studied like what you like, what you don't like, and they try to manipulate you. The magician too is that stalker, watcher, psycho energy, baby. Be so careful because you're not, it's like you're not allowing yourself to see just how nefarious this past energy is in your life because you're still in your life. They're still in your energy, still trying to talk to you, baby. So if someone reaches out in the next month, I would just be wary because on the one hand, yeah, they're really sorry and they love you, but you're also dealing with a psychopath. So the goddess of love is like, mm, I don't know about the psychopath you know maybe throw them in the sea let's see what else is coming through for my scriptures Taurus and what is going for Taurus 
Oh, what's coming through is a new beginning, baby. The Ace of Pentacles, your new beginning is here. If you wish to manifest a new love, a new beginning, a new boo-boo, uh, a new boo-boo is coming. This is a gift from the gods, baby. This is a gift of, this is like a message from the gods. This is a, a message from the angels, but also a gift. So it's someone, a new person is coming who's gonna be more like you, boo-boo. I think you were uh, dealing with an emotionally unavailable person in the past and you let that slide too much. You were too understanding of them because you're a scrumptious little, little darling baby. And what you what you deserve is someone who's more like you, who's uh, willing to put their money where their mouth is, who's willing to do the right thing by you, baby. All right, someone who someone who's able to make an honest little bull out of you as well you know whatever that means to you if you want to get married it's someone who's not going to be like i don't know about commitment you know that person's going to be like all about the commitment you know because because they love you and and that's what they want but it's a whole new way of life i do see a wedding here if you're wedding minded if you don't want to get married it doesn't have to be traditional but it's going to be you know a marriage of the mind or a marriage of the soul it's almost like the goddess is gifting you this and i'm going to be manifesting this for you as your little enchantress sorceress from the island you know like a little sorceress from the island i will be manifesting that energy for you uh with the goddess aphrodite tonight when the sun sets sun is setting soon my baby this is the time this is the twilight time this is the time to make dreams come true my baby let's manifest it together if you want to manifest something uh focus on it now and uh, maybe the energy will be a little bit stronger because we're doing it together baby uh what is a going for taurus and who is this new person awesome so what is going for you taurus is that you know your worth four of pentacles you know whatever happened with the past person who was a bit of a psycho you did not let this person get the better of you maybe they kept on using abusing you and in the end you you just like clammed up uh, in your own self and you're like okay fine then leave or fine then don't commit to me or whatever like i'm fine with myself you know i'm loving myself this person is literally touching themselves you know they're like Mwah, hugging themselves F you, boo-boo. You know what I mean? Like, you're that Taurus amazing, gorgeous boo-boo who only deserves the VIP cream of the cream, all right? No scrubs. And um, the four of uh, cups here came out. So that's interesting because that's telling me that the person who's coming in, the new person, is someone who, who, who isn't your usual type. And you may have a tendency to reject them straight out of the gate. Don't do that, bimbo. If you're talking to a new bimbo himbo from Tender, all right, anyone in between, this is a time to give someone a chance, someone who's in your usual type. Maybe it's visually speaking, maybe it's, sorry, I keep touching myself because I, um, just my little hair, brushing against my face, baby. <laughs> brushing against the wind. <clears throat> Anyways, <laughs> oh my God, I think I'm, I'm just like, I'm, I'm drunk with the sea of love, baby. This is happening to me these days. Um, but yeah, it's someone who, who's not your usual type and you might reject them. It's either someone you're already talking to, someone who's coming into your life in the next four hours, four days, four weeks, or four months. Someone's coming in and you're gonna be like, well, I don't know. But also the challenge could very well be that you're like, you know, uh, the last person, this little psychopath who's watching you right now. That person could be, you know, could have hurt you so much. You're like, no, I'm gonna clam up because I don't want to go through this trauma again. Open yourself up to love, Taurus, because you deserve the best and the best is coming. Always, it's always darker before the, um, before the dawn, baby. So, you know, someone hurts you that person needs to go uh, if you haven't m made that decision yet to like really delete them from the database this is your sign baby because a better person is coming through and also that person is going to be surprisingly good for you there's like a surprise in that there's like a little gift see it's a gift from the angels don't reject a gift from the angels because it's legitimately the angels concocted the situation so that you could meet this new person you don't want to be going against that because it's almost like you know uh, all the little nymphs and and uh, and the angels and and the little you know the little birdies and the bees they're conspiring for you to meet this new person who's coming into your life so if you're not putting yourself out there put yourself out there and if you haven't finished it with the uh, with the slightly you know cold aloof emotionally unattached person it's time to maybe get rid of them because I don't know it's like the goddess doesn't hate that energy so much because they do love you but at the same time there's something better coming through uh and you don't want to be you know stuck in a rut basically but it's all about free will on this channel baby so it's all up to you i'm just uh i'm just so grateful and amazed that you choose to spend your time with me 
thank you so much with grace and with love uh, for watching the video today. Uh, Taurus, let me know in the comments below if this resonated for you. Also, if you vibe with my channel and you enjoy my videos, why not subscribe, turn on that notification button, and of course, I like the video because liking the video really helps me out as a small creator on YouTube. Also, Taurus, my sweetheart, if you'd like to get a personal reading with me, uh, all the information is down in the description box below. I'll see, uh, ne not tomorrow, actually tonight. <laughs> what am I saying? I'll see you tonight, my darling Taurus, because there's another video coming out tonight. Uh, I love you so much, my scrumptious little boo-boo. Uh, stay moisturized, stay sparkly, stay gorgeousness, and may the angels protect you, and the goddess of love bless you. Mm. <laughs>